Welcome to our kitchen oasis. Today I'm going to show you how to make sticky date pudding with butterscotch sauce. First, you chop the dates into small pieces. They don't need to be neat, but please make sure there are no seeds left. Put the dates in a pot. and pour water and bring to boil on medium heat. When it starts boiling, stir a little while and reduce the heat to low and simmer for two minutes. Then stop the heat and add the ginger and bicarb soda. This bicarb soda will help the cake to become soft and fluffy. Stir through and stand aside to cool. In a large bowl, put softened butter and beat with an electric beater until soft and smooth. You add sugar and beat again until slightly pale and fluffy. This is about right. You add an egg and beat well. When the egg is mixed in well, you add another egg and beat well again. Adding eggs one at a time is important because it is a lot easier to incorporate eggs to butter mixture. Scrape off the butter mixture stuck on the bowl and add the third egg. And you beat well. The batter may curdle a little, but it will be alright when you mix the flour in. You sift the flour into the bowl. I'm missing the sifter a little bit, but oh well, it's home cooking. You fold in the flour gently. And when the flour is incorporated roughly like this, you add cooled dates mixture. It can be slightly warm, but not too hot. We don't want the butter melting in the batter. You mix the butter and dates very well using cutting motion like this. Please make sure they are combined well. Then you pour into the lined tin. Cover with aluminium foil. This will trap the steam and keep the cake very moist in the oven. Bake it in the preheated oven at 180 degrees or 170 if I'm forced for about an hour until an inserted skewer comes out clean. In a cold saucepan, you put butter, golden syrup, brown sugar and cream. You cook this on medium heat and stir constantly using a heat proof spatula. When the mixture bubbles up like this and thickens slightly like this, the butterscotch sauce is done. Now the sticky date pudding is baked. I hope you can see how soft and moist the pudding is. I love eating this while it's still warm with hot butterscotch sauce. Hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. See you next time.